if you want to create powerful business applications without any programming language or writing any line of code, then there is one way that is provided by Microsoft, that is Power Apps. With the help of Power Apps, anybody can create business applications. You only need to concentrate for the development of the business application and all the data and everything will be stored in the cloud. For the development of uh, these apps, you need to go to the powerapps.microsoft.com. And uh, here you have to click the start free. If you click here, then you need to give your work email address. The normal Gmail or Hotmail, Yahoo email will not work here. So you need to enter any email that is connected to any domain. So here we have uh, one website uh, that is yopmail.com and uh, you can create any name here. For example, my apps123, this is the name, my apps123 at yopmail.com and then you have to click check email. So here you can see this is your email address, myapps123 at yopmail.com. And uh, then you need to copy this email, put it here and uh, sign up, right? You will get a code and that you will receive under yopmail inbox. And because this is a temporary email and then you have to use to complete this process. Once you complete this process, so the interface will look like this. So it's a Power Apps and because uh, this is my actual account. Uh, so from this side, you can see if you click Home. So under Home, you can see different uh, data sources. So Power Apps gives you more than 200 different data sources. And uh, then you can uh, create your app, or Canvas app from blank, model driven app portal from blank and uh, then we have different uh, and here you can see different uh, templates we will explore each and everything and uh, under apps we haven't created any app yet and then under data you can see different tables export to data lake connections so and flow chatbot uh, artificial intelligence builder if you want to implement uh, ai within your uh, business applications and then solutions so let's try to create our first app so before creating any app we need to create a connection so you need to click connections and uh, here you have to select create a connection because you haven't created any connection yet we need to just click uh, connection and uh, here you can see these are the different data sources like uh, more than 200 data sources i think it's a 270 or uh, like this so we need to connect uh, you can connect with the sharepoint onedrive some connections are the premium and uh, we can uh, sheet we can connect to the sheet like a google sheet and here you click the plus sign then you have to click create and uh, select your appropriate gmail account so that uh, we can create the google sheet so it is now connecting with my gmail click ok allow and here you can see this is the associated email address with Google. And if you click here, you can see the detail or you want to switch the account. So here we have created one connection to the Google Sheet. So we need to open the Google Sheet in the, in the new tab. So you just need to search Google Sheets and uh, then we have to click the Google Sheet sign in. So now I'm connected with the Google Sheet here. So we need to create one blank sheet. The sheet name is
student data and uh, here is the name address education so the name is asim address is lahore education is msc and then the second record is quran and uh, karachi esc and the third record is yusuf and uh, isa Islamabad and the qualification is again MSc this one so these are the three records and here we can uh, rename the sheet uh, like uh, this is the name of the sheet so that, that's all uh, we have uh, so we have created one Google sheet with three records and the student and the, and the name of the sheet is student. So we need to go to the power apps. Now, now you can see here start from data because we have, we had already created data in the in the form of Google Sheet. So Google Sheet we can't see here. So that's why we have to click other data sources. And uh, this is the connection. And then this is the name of a sheet that we have created under under student data. Select this one, and then we need to connect. So it is loading. So welcome to the Power App Studio. We just need to skip, and uh, let me zoom it. So here you can see. This app is connected with the Google Sheet, and we have uh, like Islamabad, MSc, Yusuf, then the Akram, it's a BSc, see, Akram is a BSc from Karachi, so, and Lahore. So, this app is now fetching the data from Google Sheet. So, in this way, we haven't written any line of code here, and anybody can create this type of a customized business application. Are their need so this is the first app that we have created so far so in the upcoming videos we will learn a lot from different types of application different types of approaches different type of data connections how we can uh, automate all these uh, processes so stay tuned and if you have any questions please write in the comment section and if you like this video please subscribe our channel thank you